Hi, Tim from Kingdom Sewing Center in Simi Valley, California. We're going to talk about the Janome Skyline S7. And to start, we're going to talk about the frame. Solid, one-piece metal. That's what you want in any sewing machine. That's what you want something to last. That's why you want it to run quiet, smooth, and not skip stitches or anything like that. So that's where we start with is the frame, and that's the beauty of a Janome sewing machine. It's a one-piece metal frame there. We're also going to talk about, we'll start with the threading in the machine and do a little sewing on it there. We first started with a two-handed needle threader, and then they got better and they created a one-handed needle threader. We're going to show you a no hand needle threader. So we're going to go through seven there, cut the thread, push the lever down, threaded. No hands around the thread, so less chance of breaking that needle thread or little hook that goes through the eye of the needle there. Great feature there. We're going to put the fabric on here, and if you notice I reached around and lift the presser foot, but this machine has an automatic up needle down. We also have a knee lift that will when we're doing pivoting but we're going to talk about another feature here called needle down pivot so when I touch that button right there we're going to start sewing and as we're sewing every time we stop the needle will stop in the down position and the presser foot comes up automatically so if you're doing applique or any type of pivoting you just simply step on the foot control I don't have a foot control I'm using the start stop button start it again foot comes down and it sews stop again the needle comes uh, the press the needle stops down presser foot comes back up there so great feature on there we're going to take the fabric off here now presser foot came up automatically uh, we're going to open this door here very few machines you could open up the store to access anything inside there and while I have it open we're gonna show you this little feature here this is actually an option but it's an amazing option when I hook it on the side here if I can reach around as we're doing an applique stitch and we're all want detail we all want to go a little bit closer a little bit close to the edge stitch in the ditch perfect quarter inch and what I just did is I turned this magnifier right where we're looking down and you can get a magnification two four and six on there so we all want that detail we're all going blind it's just a great option there so we just want to throw that little commercial inside there um, while we're sewing a lot of times we want to stabilize the fabric so this throat plate is nine millimeters so we get some really beautiful decorative stitches with that a lot of decorative stitches there to talk about that but we also when we're sewing a lot of straight stitch we need to stabilize the fabric more so you're gonna see a single hole right here where we could stabilize the fabric even better there so to change the needle plate we're not going to change it. We're just going to show how it comes off. You just simply, no screws, you simply push the button right there. The needle plate comes off. You put the new needle plate on and snap it on, and we're ready to go. Free arm there. We could put all of our attachments in here or the back or the top there. What's really important in sewing sometimes we're going to be sewing on a quilt or something where the fabric is shifting there so you could buy an, an add-on walking foot that hooks up to the needle bar but that's just putting more pressure on there what this foot is doing this is actually linked into the mechanics of the machine so if we have the stitch length on a stitch length of 2 or 2.5 when we hook this on this links in the back this AccuFeed foot is actually grabbing the fabric on the top like the feed teeth are on the bottom and evenly pulling it through the system. So this is a true dual feed system. Janome calls it an AccuFeed foot there. We were talking about the precision of stitching in the ditch or next to the edge. Uh, this has these feet that will snap off and you could put the new foot on so you don't have to buy a whole new walking foot for each one right there. So great feature there. Very few machines have what's called a true dual feed system. The Janome machine does, and I'm going to lower that down. Got to get that and snap that on there. We also have an extra high lift there. If you notice how high we just lifted that, so we're lifting up five eighths of an inch. So if you have a binding or anything like that, very great feature there that you don't see on too many machines there. I'm going to show you a little secret here that very few Janome dealers know, very few customers know there. You saw me touch the start stop button before. I touch it and it sews. I touch it and it stops. 
But sometimes if we have it on a, on a very fast speed, we touch that and it takes off. A lot of machines do that. This is a secret, don't tell anybody, but Janome has what's called, a, has a soft start and a soft stop. So I'm gonna hold this down and you'll notice it will so slow until I'm out of a critical area. Let go of it. So the distance you wanna go when you're coming to the end, you could hold that button down, so now it's going to slow stop right to the end of exactly where you want it to stop. That is an exclusive Janome has. They don't really advertise. Most people don't even know about it. You do now there. So that's, uh, we have, um, I've got to look at my notes here because I know I'm forgetting something. Uh, we have a great feature of lettering on this, so if you want to name and date something, you have that capability. A great feature in this machine here is whenever we select a stitch, a regular straight stitch or a blanket stitch or a zigzag stitch, and we select it and it's the way the factory did it. This machine has what's called favorite stitch, and by selecting the favorite stitch, so let's say I'm going to do a straight stitch and I want to have a long stitch length because I'm going to be on canvas for the next two weeks, and it needs to be a longer stitch. So you could change the stitch length and touch the favorite stitch button, and it's not burying it into a memory, it is the new default of the stitch. So you have the capability of doing that on 10 different stitches, a blanket stitch, a zigzag, an applique stitch. You could memorize that, it's the way you want it for the life of that stitch on the machine or you could change it back to the default whenever you want. So a really nice feature there. This button right here is called the pattern in button. So if we're doing a decorative stitch like a heart or um, a diamond, whatever the shape is, I'm not sure when that pattern ends. You just touch that button, it will finish the pattern and then completely stop there. So you're looking at top line features but not on the big, bad machines that are this wide and very expensive. So very affordable, well under $2,000. Come in and talk to us. We'll be happy to show you the machine. A big advantage of getting a machine from us is we're not gonna just sell you it and give you the factory warranty, which is one year on the labor, five years electronics. We give you five years, free lessons, any issues, any adjustments. We're going to stand behind it. We're going to show you how to use the machine. You will not be afraid of this machine there. So come and talk to us at Kingdom Sewing Center in Simi Valley at 805-579-1571. Thank you.